what's happening for him. I'll be the first to admit that I love jumping on trampolines, like this girl. It looks fun, right? Yeah, keep watching. Although it's funny, it's kind of weird that the trampoline broke. I mean, if you look, this girl isn't like overweight or anything. In fact, she's actually rather thin. But you know, from this point on, her friends will refer to her as that fat girl who broke the trampoline. Hey, way to go, fatty. Hide your chapstick or that fat girl will eat it all. I'm just saying, you know they're gonna make fun of her. Forum, I need you to check out this video of this drunken woman who really, really wants to dance. I am f***ing great. Oh, f***ing dance. What is, what is the percolator dance? It's time for the percolator. That's the dance? It's time for the percolator. Can you make a about that? It's time for the percolator. Go ahead, girl, dance. Do the percolator. Get up on that glass table and show us how it's done. Christ. You ready for this? Oh, we're ready. Show us how to percolate, girl. It's time for the percolator. <laughs> it's time for the percolator. <laughs> All right. Can you you're stepping in Pepsi. But I'm not going to want Oh, damn. Wait, the glass went into her what? It went into my... Yeah, the video cuts off right there. So, Forum, the glass went into her what? I think it stuck directly into her self-esteem. What's funny is that even though she's not really fat, from this point on, her friends are going to refer to her as that stupid bitch who got drunk and did the percolator on top of a glass table. We all hate trolls, and I actually have a good time making fun of them. But I have even more fun watching someone react when trolls have pissed them off. Like this guy. You know you 13, 14, and 15 year old fucking little kids who are telling me I need to fucking lose weight. And fucking tell me I'm a fucking idiot on my fucking videos. Fuck you! You comment on my video, great! You're fucking watching my video, great, I love it! But you think I'm a fucking asshole? You think I like to see fucking comments on my videos when people tell me I'm fat? Alright, don't call this guy fat. He's obviously a bit worked up over it. I know I'm fucking fat. You don't need to tell me I'm fat. Why the fuck do you have to keep commenting on my videos telling me I'm a fat ass and I'm an idiot? Because you have such good content? You get me all worked up. I'm pissed off all day. I'm reading my comments. You're coming to my cell phone. I'm checking my email. I'm getting these comments. Fat, gay, idiot, dumbass. What the fuck? If you really think that I'm a fat asshole, then why the fuck do you take your time to comment on my video? All right, chill out, man. Dude, you know what you should do when you're feeling upset? It's time for the percolator. It's time for the percolator. <laughs> Okay, maybe not. You know what time it is for him. It's time for the comment question of the day, which comes from a user named JT89 for breakfast. And he said, You can have a swimming pool full of anything you wanted besides water. What would you choose and why? Yeah, that's a nice flag in the background, JT. Let's just hope you weren't wishing for a pool of racism. Now, I don't like JT's flag, but I do like his question. If you could have a swimming pool full of anything besides water, what would it be? Leave your interesting or creative responses in the comments section below. And don't forget to submit your video for the next episode's comment question of the day. But thanks for watching today's episode of Equals 3. I'm Ray William Johnson, and I approve this message. All right, two quick announcements. First of all, my Facebook is full. It won't let me add any more friends, but I'm absolutely very active on Twitter, and I'm very active on another site called Daily Booth, where I post pictures every day. So feel free to follow me on either one of those sites. Also, my musical comedy group that I have with my friends called Fatty Spins, we just put up another video about uh, Muppet sex, and it's pretty freaking awesome, so I'm gonna have to ask you to go check out the video and comment at least 120 times. And of course, favorite and rate it. And I think that's all. I'll see you guys in a few days. So tell me, Forum, if you saw Osama bin Laden in person, what would you say to him? You know we straight with you and your mom. For sore in the Walmart, picking out your drawers. Big Dolly parting hair like an 80s prom queen, but her ass was looking good. I gotta go. Fuck you! Fuck you! Fuck you!